At 1.45 a.m., Chamawo and RCMP responded to a report of a disturbance at a home in Easterville. They found a 32-year-old woman in critical condition. Paramedics could not save her and she died of her injuries. A second victim, a 35-year-old woman with non-life-threatening injuries, was then located a short distance away. She was taken to hospital in Winnipeg and remains in stable condition. RCMP arrested two girls in connection to the homicide, a 13-year-old and a 14-year-old. Both remain in custody. RCMP Major Crimes Forensic Identification Services and Chamawawin RCMP are continuing their investigation this week. Last Saturday evening around 7.50 p.m., South Indian Lake RCMP responded to a report of a deceased male in a wooded area outside the Opipan Napawin Cree Nation. Officers later found the body of a 61-year-old man with injuries to his body. No arrests have been made in connection with this incident. His death is now being treated as a homicide and that investigation continues. And on the Lake St. Martin First Nation in the Interlake region of Manitoba, RCMP Major Crimes arrested a 15-year-old boy in relation to the shooting of a 32-year-old woman at a home there. The shooting happened last Wednesday around 9 a.m. Gypsumville RCMP found the deceased woman shortly after. The 15-year-old has been charged with second-degree murder and remains in custody. That investigation is ongoing. All of the suspects arrested in all three incidents so far are under the age of 18 and cannot be named.